How to Brown the Choo Choo Train! What is up guys, Choo Choo here, I'm going to show you guys how to build an old school train, western style. First things first, I want to give a shout out to Legion from Minecraters for helping me out with the train station, it looks absolutely boss. And uh, it's basically what was built beside the train, so you can see us working on this. Now first things first, you just want to do three small wheels onto your train track, and you want to do one big back one for the moment, right? So your train track is made of, up, up of wooden slabs, gravel, and... Uh, stone stairs so you want to kind of get that right i don't know uh, if the stone stairs are about five apart and then i basically brought it out by one stone or one gravel and then stone stairs at the edges there as well so that's basically how you do your train tracks so you can slow this clip down at any any point in the whole tutorial so you can see how to do these things because i find if you do it too slow it gets boring so what i like to do is speed the video up and you guys can take it at whatever pace you want and i'll talk you through my mindset as i'm building it okay so first things first i wanted to get the long engine style out pretty good now the, the engine has to be very long compared to the because first mistake i don't want to do on a train i'm sure a lot of you guys do this is it's just out of proportion so don't don't do it too small or too stubby and short and uh as you can see i'm just messing around here with just uh trying to find the right material to fill the fill the big back wheels and the best thing i come up with uh was um <coughs> iron bars now this train itself is not my design i basically was playing hunger games on pc came across this across this awesome map with uh, lots of cool stuff on it and um, basically I had a western train on it and I was just like I kept getting requests from the last videos on how to do a train so I just said had a quick look at that and uh, memorized as much as I could and came back and built my own version of it so I'll put the link for that IP in the description if you want to go check that one out as well and uh, basically that's what this is based off so it's not in a comp like it's the first time I've done tutorial on something that wasn't my design but uh, I, I definitely thought the train just looked so cool I had to build and you know and you have that kind of thing basically so that's that and first thing you want to do then is just start doing some detail on the engine now i kind of just you kind of just randomly put some things down trying to imagine where the locomotive would be and stuff like that and then there's the main part you got to get the big uh the big uh, thing that knocks them out of the way you know what i mean <laughs> you want to have that done nice and uh kind of gradually down to half slabs make it look like it's going to chop someone up that's what i did with it. and then once you have that what you want to do is just kind of figure out what way you want how far you want to bring back the main part of the engine now i brought it back about nine or ten blocks and then just started on a second wheel which i like hid behind it right so the whole idea of this is it looks like the wheel is tucked under like uh whatever the iron that the thing's made of the train so as you can see you just gotta <coughs> get that worked out and get that all ready and then you want to just start adding buttons to the side. And the reason the buttons are good detail is because it just kind of gives it that look that the <coughs> steel was kind of like um, pressed together with those like metal clamp thingies. You know what I mean? And uh, I'm not. I don't build trains in real life. I know my name's Choo Choo. Wee <coughs> so uh, that's basically that. Now what you want to do as well is just basically get your roof. Do a half slabs. Now we don't have upside down stairs or anything like that. So I just try to do as much detail as possible using the box we have on the xbox version and i honestly think this train looks better than the original that i saw but that's probably just because i love it because i built it myself so as you can see you just do both sides identical start bringing out where the main uh, car where the main uh, engine room is just bring that out a bit wider than the actual engine itself build some kind of old school doors into it <coughs> and then you can uh, basically that's your main engine of the train done so we're halfway through how to do the train um, I hope you guys will enjoy at the end of the video you'll see the end product I, I spent probably two days building the actual train itself and Legion my good friend from Minecraft shout out to him he done the train station and it's amazing so make sure you go to check his channel out he's also an awesome youtuber guys so definitely go check out Legion also aka Minecraft I'll put him in the description or you can click him on screen now so uh, basically what I want you to do is just fill out inside whatever way you want I just done a kind of random step up because this is such a big scale i didn't know what way to do the inside without uh <coughs> without doing too much like um of a slope towards the engine so what i done basically was got furnaces and filled inside the engine room with a lot of furnaces to try look like an engine room and then you could light some of these up and fill them with coal for added effect and then just add some shelves in there and stuff and then uh <coughs> basically what you want to do is just forget about that for the time being and start working <coughs> 
And you're doing your back carriage, you want to just check out the width of the train track. Now this is attached onto the actual uh, engine and um, <coughs> main hub of the train. So what I want you guys to do is just count out how wide you could get done your train track. I always do it at odd number, so it's about 11 wide. So I hope you guys can see that. Just do your base so that people can't climb under and stuff. And then what you want to bring do is bring it out by one on the outside. Leave it a two gap at the front there. And then at the back leave like a three gap just to give it that kind of uh just give it that effect of i don't know what way why they build them like that in real life but just to copy basically a real life version and uh <coughs> then what you want to do is just kind of bring it down like so that the reason i put those kind of full blocks there is just to kind of give it that uh open the back opens look like you can kind of open the back and slide out whatever you want which is what old school uh trailers is what i'm going to call this as used to do so hope you guys can see how basically simplistic this is you just uh you just really want to just make a bucket <laughs> a big old bucket and then fill it whatever you want so this time i uh used obsidian which is on the original train and to make it look like coal and you'll see at the end of the video that i filled all the different carts with different stuff or tra uh, trailers with all different stuff but i think obsidian just looks cool for coal so you want to put random bits of that everywhere looks really cool so you can see that's really sweet and uh next of all i just want to add some buttons onto your trailer as well so as you can see slow down the video whatever way you want and you'll be able to do all this yourself just have to do it fast and make sure that's nice and symmetrical at the back there as well so that's basically the first part now you what you want to do is just add more wheels okay so you want to basically put maybe four wheels on your back carriage so but they're make sure they're small and they sit on top of the rail they don't go into the rail so I'll show you that now do them two apart and you want to just fill out the snap the blocks above like that so it gives it kind of the, the it's overhanging the wheels look if you know what i mean so i hope you guys have enjoyed this tutorial it's very uh a lot longer to build than my normal ones and then you just want to light up the train the whole way across put some nice lights at the front there so what well, i hope you guys enjoy this because mainly you requested a train a lot and i just really had to get you the train i think this is the coolest type one if you want more trains i don't call choo -choo. and uh, if you want more trains and stuff just comment below and i'll do like a modern one my own design and uh things like that but there's basically the train and i'm gonna just put some smoke reel up here and finish off the tutorial and i hope you guys enjoyed this don't forget you can slow it down and build your own version choo choo out Thanks for watching Choo Choo's Gaming. Do not forget to subscribe and if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button. Choo Choo here and I'm going to bring you some more awesome content. And everybody that's on the banter train, let's keep this train steaming. And to all you haters, shut the up. Choo Choo out.